to stream it. We're live. Free gaming. Let's go. Yeah. Um, we're fifty percent of our way to our follower goal. It's pretty awesome. Only took ten days to get there. Because we got that five days ago. I set the follower goal on the first Saturday when everyone was gone. But it is gaming time. Okay, uh, let me turn on the music a little bit. I have to turn it up the music a little bit. Oops. Alright. Yeah. Then I'm gonna I'm gonna pop out my chat. The, yeah. And then. I'm checking the stream and I don't see the Discord thing popped up, so maybe you could do that as well. Uh, I do that I whenever do we're that actually when doing. Okay, uh, yeah. I do that whenever we're actually doing the game. Anyways, I put the okay. yeah, I put the thing up so you can see cool. the chat, even if there isn't a chat right now. Uh, no, no high chat yet. Yeah, no yeah, high so chat two yet. People, I'm just one of them. Yeah. Alright. It's weird how it counts of you as one of the viewers when you're streaming. Yeah. You're the one streaming. It shouldn't count you. Okay, so. Uh. Does anyone have any questions related to the campaign from last time? Not really. Okay. Oh, there's a third person. Is that you, EV, or do we have a no. viewer? That's not me. We but, have uh, a viewer! Hello, I have viewer! No I, have, I have no vital abilities. Hi, chat. That's all. Hi, chat. Uh, okay, let's get down to business and enjoy the soy. Um. No, I'm soying up! No, we're soyed up. We're all like soyed up oh, right now. We still now. have the box from the pirate fight. Do we? Hold on. <laughs> I don't have the actual roll twenty twenty three open right now. I'm so gonna open that up. We're supposed to have that. I, I am the only one who's in the roll twenty thing. Yeah. All right. Let's see. Uh, should I do a recap, or no? Uh, for us or the viewers? Both of you. Uh, I guess only if the viewer wants it. Chat, do you want to recap or not? Very quiet, chat. Chat is... Yeah, shit is not speaking. <laughs> I did not know something was talking to me. Talking about this week. Maybe we're just hallucinating and there isn't chat here. There is chat! Yeah, there's gotta be a chat. Maybe we're just like. Maybe we're just weird. It's a group hallucination. Yeah, it's like a ghost. Uh Oh no! Been haunted by chat. chat. Ooh. <laughs> Go chat! Go chat! Unfortunately, the active viewer from last time is unable to make it to the stream, which is sad. But that's okay. Cause you know, it'll still be archived, and they said they're gonna watch the archive when they get home. Hey. Ooh, so this is just a random person this time. Yeah, this is actually just like a random high chat. Ooh. Uh, I guess we should recap then. Yeah, we should recap. Alright. So, last time on Dungeons Dragons, uh, three fucking idiots ran around 
Uh, they made a wizard. Oh, well, I'm idiot number one. Yes, that's idiot number one. Um. Idiot number two. Yeah, and idiot. idiot number three is not here right now. Yeah. But uh. So you met a wizard. The wizard was like, "Ho ho ho! I am the mailman," and then uh. Told you all to help each other. All three of the people were like, damn, okay. And then they wandered off. And they took a nap. Fought a pirate. And then, uh, took another second nap. But only one of them did that. And then, did. yeah, idiot number one took a nap. Okay. You, you took a nap. Why I was just going to buy stuff. Yeah. You took all the damage in the pirate fight. Yeah. I died so fast. Or and then, die. uh... The party followed the blue light and then fell into the pit. Bird falls in the pit. Yeah. How could a bird well, fall? Birds fly. I don't know. I, I have decided I will fall. That's that's how it really goes. Yeah. I mean, to be fair, you weren't really preparing to fly, so... I'd say it was like, you know, it makes sense that you wouldn't be able to fly. But who knows? Oh shit, I actually- hold on. I gotta change stream info real quick. Yeah. There we go. Uh, I had to change it from part one to part two on the stream info. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh. So yeah, this should be a really fun session. Uh, we're going to be starting in about... 20 minutes or so. Uh, unless as he showed up earlier. You're only the idiot of all time. Yeah. Um, hello chat. Hello chat. Waving emoji. Waving emoji. Waving hello. emoji. I gotta set up like. I gotta set up like a fun little thing where I can just put images up on the stream like a fucking like dog waving or something. <laughs> yeah. Chat. Don't worry, I understand. Whenever I watch streams or videos or something, I never really interact. Yeah. So, I understand. Yeah. But you are still with us in heart. So, we Friends will still be entertaining. Watch, watch the thing, you know? Uh, Sunday. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Get Goober. Most of the people who watch our streams have, like, the attention span of a TikTok kid, so I'm glad you've stuck around. Yeah. Nowadays, people are weird. And you are an awesome exception. Keep being awesome. Be excellent to each other. That's what they say in, uh, that one movie... That one movie. Pretty most, uh, pretty much most kids' movies. Nah, it's like an actual like quote from a movie. Oh. Yeah. Be excellent to each other. It's from Bill and Ted. Oh, okay. Yeah. Hello, idiot number three. Hello, idiot number two. Why? No, I'm colors? one. I'm idiot number one. You're idiot number two. Hey, da idi doma no So true. I actually you... understood that. Why are you colors? Um, I don't know. Like, a cat At first, when you. Go ahead. 
Oh my god. Yeah, he can't see this, but um, if he ended up a free. Woo! Hello. I recognize that. Hello! Hello. I, I don't. Smile emoji. Yeah, neither do I. What up? Uh, one of my Twitter moves. Nice. Smile emoji. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. Uh, Ezzy, I asked it to the other yeah. two. Do you have any questions related to the campaign that you would like to ask? Not really. Okay, cool. Uh, I saw that emoji from afar, and I thought it was like, I thought it was like a weird face. I thought it was clown hair. Clown hair. I what the fuck do you mean clown hair? You're bad. Okay. You know what I mean, like the the wig, the clown wig. It looks nothing like one of those. What? I mean, <laughs> it doesn't. My vision was blurry at the time, and I it just saw rainbow. It's not the color of that. It's not rainbow. It's yellow. Like that's pure yellow. No. With like a little red bit. And blue. It does not. It is green. yellow with like a little brown smiley and brown eyes and like little white teeth. Oh, talking about Azzy's. Oh. oh I think you were talking about? The emoji clown on hair. the chat. That is... Oh. That is clown hair. No, that's not clown hair. No. Yeah, it's a smiley face. Yeah, it's a smiley face emoji. Hey cat, hey cat. Yeah, that's a uh, Duma Noma Tor. Uh, hello. Wave emoji, wave emoji, wave emoji. I really gotta set up like a dog waving gif on the stream. Hold on. I gotta get like a good one. Doggy spot in chat. Hi, hi. Pet, pet. Yeah. A, bu a bunch of fucking creatures in. A bunch of creatures in chat and in the streamer side. Yeah. I like how the stream just went black when I did that. I did not mean for that to happen. You simply, you simply have pet, pet a dog. <clears throat> pet a dog way too much. Yeah. <laughs> I just wanted to do oh, this. It's so small. There you go. <laughs> Yay! Dog waving emoji. Ah. This is the Who's perfect in a... way to get viewers. Oh. Yeah, it is. Silly doggy. Um, we got like ten minutes to start. As it better, as it better come back. I mean, it doesn't really matter because like they're they chose number three, so like it'll be fine probably. Wait, what? Wait. Anyways, um. Let's see. I, I kinda know Swedish, but I, I don't. Noma tre? Oh, number three. Yeah. Oh, yeah, idiot number three. Yeah, Duma Noma tre. Oh, alright. Let's see. We got like, I don't know, 13 minutes to stream about? 13 yeah. minutes? To fucking it to idiot time and as he's yeah. still not here. Yeah, but it's okay because uh um, and... Oh hi! Back there you and you're talking about how I'm not here, which I think is hi. Really funny. Wave emoji, wave emoji, hi. wave emoji. Hi chat. <laughs> yeah, say hi to chat, we have a chat. Hello, chat. One dog in chat. Yeah, hold on. 
<laughs> Hold on, Ezzy. I gotta send you, uh... Yeah. Or not send you. I gotta show you this. This is what's on the uh -huh. stream right now. Oh, there's a dog waving. Yeah. Love it. I just set that up. I was like, I wanted something to like say hello to chat, so I just set that up. I guess set it back to the uh, back to the slideshow now. Wow. Did fuck Lloyd's kind bird dithering, my beloved. Yeah. I forgot to loop the music, and it almost just went to another song that was going to be used in the fucking campaign. Uh-oh. Yeah? Do not- It played like not. one note from it, and then I switched it back, and then set it to loop. I don't think the doggy was here before, um... Before we did the recast. <laughs> yeah. I'm not sure, actually. I yeah, don't I don't know. I... Idiots fell down a hole. They're supposed to help each other because the wizard is the mailman. They see, it's the fastest way to yeah, that's, that. That's good yeah, enough. they fought a pirate, fell down, there's a wizard. So uh, it works. Idiot number one got, got obliterated by a pirate. The wizard yeah. might be trying to trick us, might not. We don't know. It's my burger. I didn't make it. I just, I just did the image editing. Hold on, let's see. What's this burger? That's a wonderful burger. Do you mind if I put this up on the stream for everyone to see? You can, yes, but I don't have the, the copyright for it. Fuck. I just put the dithering on it. Yeah, that's a good point. <laughs> okay, to be fair, the artist that made it, made it in like the 80s. It'll probably on, be fine. In Amiga. Oh my I don't god, think it's that care. burger! Oh my god, it's, I know what burger you're It's 4-byte burger. It's 4-byte burger. How it's do you know burger. what burger that is? It's a very specific burger. I know that burger. Uh, burger. Show the burger up. Yeah, putting the burger up. There you what go. Cat? What kind of burger did you eat? <laughs> nice. Oh, burger. We're just talking about burgers in the chat while we're fucking. Then I'll put the dog back up. Why is it so big now? There we go. Yeah. Trigger. Make it take Trigger. up the entire Trigger. screen. Okay. <laughs> there you go. Yes. The dog. Why are you so excited about the dog gift? I don't know. We love the dog gift. This is like... It's a dog. Just waving hi. That's all it is. That's all it will ever be. Yeah. Dog. Uh, how do you feel about starting the campaign like 10 minutes early? Um, I'm a little opposed because I have food. Fucking. Alright. Eat the fuck up then. Do my number three. Do my number three. Are hungry. Eat. Make sure to mute you... so we don't hear you chewing on the burger. Yeah. I don't want to hear no munches. A little funny. I don't think I don't think chat understands Swedish. Yeah, I don't think they do. I, chat, do you understand Swedish at all? Yes or no? Wait, I think you can just. Put I don't a think you can make three. polls right now. Yeah, I can't make polls right now. I would have to set up it's like a plug. It's too small. It's like uh, a plug you again. Don't have chat open. Not about that. Yeah. Damn, no Svenska. Swedish is bad! I'm trying to learn Swedish, but I also don't really know. Yeah. Hey. So, do no the Duma and Gelska. For the. Hey. Yeah. Ne Svenska. <laughs> you said. You say while speaking Swedish. I forgot I had the dog on the stream. Oops. Back to the slideshow. <laughs> no, the 
dog gets obliterated. Yeah, I had to close some tabs real quick. I have like a copious amount of tabs open. Yeah, same. I have a fucking I have a PDF for an entire book open. Why? Why are you reading like I don't know, are you reading Roy Keats while you're fucking doing this? I just have it open, okay? Actually how how is that book? I wanna know. Uh I've only read the first chapter so far, but it's very good. Nice. Yeah. Uh it is far too long of a book. Uh Fair enough, LOL. Yeah. Hold on. Oh. Be, 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 be. Let's see. Okay, 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 okay. No, we lost the lone chatter. No. The, the, the mute chatter. Yeah. The one that didn't want to talk. My chat. It's so sad. Uh, the entirety of the War and Peace series is 364 chapters long. Mm. Yeah. Uh, to my knowledge, the book is all about Russian politics. Wow. Yeah. Politics. I would not be interested in politics. Me, me, me. Alright, gotta start getting the music ready for the start of this session. Five more minutes. Yeah, we have five minutes. That's why I'm setting up stuff for the stream. No, I don't want the forest. Okay. That's great. I'm getting record heat where I am. That's great. Uh, Evie, flip a coin for me, please. Flip a coin. Flip a coin. Gotcha. Yeah, just tell me if it's heads or tails. Heads or tails. Either. Just tell me the outcome. Gotcha. Yeah. And I'm not doing that in real life, fuck. What? Heads. Alright, cool. Uh, eh. Eh, 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 eh. Yeah. All right. Uh, Zach. Yep. Would you like me to put the music that the viewers are hearing on the stream for you? Yes. All right. I would like that. I will do that now. Should be working yeah. now, so you can probably hear yeah, it. Yeah, I can yeah. hear it. Awesome. Can you turn the volume up just a little bit? There you go. Yeah, that's good. Awesome. Because I would rather it be too loud, because I can just turn the volume down on the screen. Yeah. But if it's too quiet, I already have it on max volume. Yeah. Um, okay. So... We are. Let me check the time. About two minutes. Yeah, about two minutes. More than two minutes. Yeah. I was just opening your roll twenty. Uh. It, it has been opened. Yeah. By the way. Half an hour. I would recommend both you, Zach, and Izzy, like all three of you. I don't know why I said you, Zach, and Izzy. I could have just said all of you. All uh, right. In the chat window, there is a drop-down menu that says as. You can use that to speak as your character. Oh, okay. Yeah. There so we, we should use that instead yeah, of... Yeah, you should use that. Like, uh... 
Yeah, Eevee's very out of type because Alvora, Swift Beak, Squawk. Uh. Bark. Now Zach has to make a dwarf noise. I don't. Um. Dwarf noises are like rock and stone! Rock and stone. Grunt! <laughs> Her. Her. Just villager I mean, noise. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> yeah. One minute to stream. Uh. Before the stream, how are you all today? I'm okay. How are you? I'm doing pretty good. I, I stayed I up pretty late last night see. doing writing, but you know. It should be a fun and good stream. Dwarf noises. Dwarf noises. Alright. I know you don't have to, but I hope all of you do, like, a special voice for your character. Yeah, 20 minutes to stream. By the way, uh, Ezzy and Eevee, there is sound on the Discord stream, so you can hear the music that the chat is hearing. Hello, chat. Yeah, I, I can hear it. It's pretty cool. Yeah. Uh, how did you? How did you set that up? Oh, it's just done through like a YouTube chat. To be quite frank with you. All right. How many chatters? One. Just one. Hi. Uh, okay. Is time. Yeah. All right. So. Uh, we start with Alvora. Uh, Alvora, you find yourself falling down this pit. It is very long. And just as you're able to see the ground of said pit, everything goes black. You wake up in a very, very magical place a place that's familiar yet you don't know anything about you are on the edge of a diving board there are other owlins surrounding you they all seem to be cheering and you're wearing some kind of noble uniform what do you do Yeah? Alright. Uh, as you begin your dive, you kind of, like, you kind of do like a swan dive right off the side of the thing. I just actually showed the stream on the stream. Fuck! That's kind of funny. Truly? Truly? Yeah, I actually streamed really one of the moments of all time. Um, oh yeah, make sure to have the Discord overlay. Yeah, I'm gonna put that up shortly. I just have it like this for a very particular reason. Um, so, as you're falling, you can see that this city is in fact not just any typical city, but rather it is floating in the air. There is a cloud underneath it carrying it upwards. And... As you start to fall down, you start to feel cold. So cold, it starts to burn beneath your feathers. She sudden, uh, Elvora suddenly tries to stop, stop the fall by quickly flapping her wings. All right, roll me a acrobatics check. Uh, alright. So, you manage to slow your descent, and you slowly touch onto the ground. Um. And as you touch to the ground, you feel the gust of wind of a blizzard. You are on the snow. 
Things are starting to fade out, and you feel like you might need to rest soon. She looks for any kind of shelter that she can fit in, of course. Uh, roll me a investigation check. Oh. Uh, you managed to find a small campfire nearby. It is already lit, and there is a banner next to it. The banner has a symbol you don't recognize, yet it feels familiar as well. What the- what is- what does it look like? Uh, it is a green banner with a kind of like face drawn on it and a brass coloration. I go to approach camp. Alright. You approach the camp, and as you fall down to take a rest, you start to feel very heavy. And if you have no objection, that is where you fall asleep. I, you just appear to be very tired. Yes, then, then that's my choice. Alright. You close your eyes. Durkin. Yes. You too suddenly have everything go black as you hit the cave floor. And you find yourself home. You've just come home from a very long day at work, although, interestingly, rather than a sword strapped to your back, you have a pickaxe there. It is a very nice steel pickaxe, with your name carved on it and runes. As you approach your house, you can tell that your kid is having a wonderful time. They're playing in the yard, your wife is cooking a beautiful meal, everything is wonderful. Everything is perfect. all just a bad dream. As you finally get to relax. Um, as you enter the home, you can see your very nice, comfortable chair. It's a beautiful green chair. There are brass accents to it. And as you take a rest. Yeah, as you sit in the chair, you fall asleep for a nice short nap. Now, Versus. Azzy. Oh. Hi. Um Do you not know your own character's name? No, I was just like I was just like facing out, I'm sorry. You're good. Um You suddenly wake up and you are on a matted floor. You are wearing a very, very interesting looking cloth outfit. And in front of you, there is an elderly human. As you human. see them, you instinctively bow, which is peculiar considering you've never bowed to anyone. What do you do? Um, do I recognize this person? They feel familiar, you do not know them. Uh, can you describe the clothes I'm wearing? Uh, they seem to be Asian in appearance. Okay. They're very traditional. And somewhat, they're somewhat bulky, I suppose, is a way to say it. Is it, like, bulky as in big, or bulky as in cumbersome? Uh, it's bulky as a big. Like, it droops off your wrists and off of your, like, paws. Okay. Yeah. What's... Am I, like, in a building? Yeah. Can you describe the building? Uh, the building seems to be mostly wood with a matted floor. 
uh, there are candles set up in a circle around you, which give a very strong scent. What is the scent? Uh, roll an investigation. Uh, the scent is, very interestingly, the scent of bread. However, not just any bread, but rather the bread your mother used to make for you every day. That's very specific. Yeah. You did roll a very high roll. Yeah, you did roll a very high roll. That's fair. It gives an almost rich, buttery aroma. Your mother loved butter and bread. I always thought it was the secret to making good bread. What is, um... The build, does the building have windows? Uh... There are no windows, but there are lattices that look outside. What does outside look like? Uh... There are paths and there are buildings. All road up. They mostly look like homes, but a few of them do look like storage places and other kind of like shrines okay yeah what's the weather like i uh, hold on I'm actually gonna change to ambience real quick i forgot that i had the fucking like blizzard ambience on oopsies oopsie oopsies i guess that was for ev yeah what was mine supposed to be I hold on. Let me play that one real quick. It was supposed to be this, but uh, yeah. Okay, kind of ominous. Back to yeah, back to Azzy. All right, so yeah, there's a lot of buildings outside. There are statues which have little bowls in front of them for offerings. Generally, a very peaceful place. Can I? Can you describe the human more in depth? Sure thing. Um, they have a very long, silky beard, and they're wearing clothing very similar to your own. However, it is dyed in a green coloration with brass accents. Uh, you can go right ahead. You can say whatever you wish to them. I use the chat thing, unless I, you don't want me to do that. Oh, uh, I mean, I would prefer you not, but like, it's all good. We actually Who are you? can't pick too good. There we go. Alright. Uh, they give a smile. Their teeth are incredibly clean. Like, unnaturally clean. And they open their silvery eyes. And they simply say, Apprentice, please be quiet during our meditation. Is there anything else, like, in the room? I... Uh, there is nothing else in the room. I guess I shut up then. Alright. Um. Can I just like close my eyes and sit there for a bit? Yeah. Uh, you close your eyes and try to kind of assume the posture of meditating. And. With that, the three of you awaken at the bottom of a cavern. Well, what happened? I was. At my old house. Where this pirate fucking. I just wish this was just a bad dream. I want to go back. Teach. 
tries her best to burn that flag in her own mind, but All right. it doesn't really work. Yeah. Hello, mm -hmm. I'm just gonna change the ambience real quick. So, I guess we fell down a pit, I guess. We sure okay. did. Yeah. Um, <laughs> you could hear the sound of rushing water nearby. And you could see the light of the hole up ahead, although it looks like something has collapsed over top of you, making it so you can't really get up there. I right, look around for anything. Oh, yeah. I was just about to say that. I guess uh, I'd be an assistant. An assist. Yeah, both of you I'm roll a d20 for uh, or investigation roll. I don't have roll. a d20. Yeah, investigation roll. Just do an investigation roll. Oh, right. Yeah. yeah. You're investigating. Uh, hold on, I'm trying to, like, find the thing again. Oh, wait, that's the wrong one, I think. Shoot, I can't. Uh-oh. Uh... -oh. uh Clicking on my character. Oh, here we go. Found it. Yeah. And then what role? Investigation. Investigation. Okay. Yikes. Ooh. Okay. All right. Um. Durkin doesn't manage to realize anything. Although, uh, Elvora, you managed to, you managed to spot a goblin who is holding Durkin's backpack. They were hiding behind she, a rock. Uh, she jabs the door for her wing. The door? Me? Yeah. <laughs> With the wing, it because a it's like goblin. a poke. No, yeah, it's just like a poke. They're like poking oh. me. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, whoa. She points at the goblin and uh, pokes the door for her backpack. Uh, hey, her get wings. back here with my backpack. Yeah, so. Exactly. I give chase. I uh, not right. chase because I just run after him. Yeah. Um, you start running after the goblin and roll me an acrobatics check. All right. Nice. Ooh. Damn. Um, the goblin tries to throw a. They try to throw a weapon at you. And as you see the sword coming at you, despite the fact that it's kind of hard to see in here, you leap right over it. I mean, and, I do have dark vision. Yeah. That makes sense. And right onto the goblin. I. I follow. All right. Uh, so, so I'm on, on the goblin. Now, yeah, right? you're on them. You have them pinned so I, down. Yeah, I, I try to get my backpack back. All right, that'll be a contested strength pull. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um. Okay. So, uh, you see the goblin with the backpack, and you reach for the bag, and start trying to yank it from its arms. It tries to give up a little bit of a fight. Um, you managed to dislocate both of its arms. Oh! And you have received your backpack again. No one messes with my backpack. I have a question about this universe. Yeah, go ahead. Okay, are goblins inherently evil? Uh, they're not inherently evil, although it's more of goblin society that's evil. Okay. Yeah. Society! Yeah. So I just dislocated the arm, not like pulled it out. Yeah, no, you didn't pull it out. It's just like okay. they can't really move their arms. Okay. I now check Can my I... backpack, backpack to make sure that I'm not missing anything. Yeah, everything's I in there. I just like... diver's brain rot. I almost said tack tack. Amazing. Go ahead, Can I just like wander up to the goblin and like pick it up, like one would pick up like a cat, like under its arms. Yeah. Uh, okay. You can do that. Can I shove the goblin's arms, like the shoulder, back into their sockets? 
Uh, yeah, that'll be a medicine check. Okay. Uh, you pick up the goblin and very painfully, you shove its shoulders back into place. And it lets out like a little cry as you do that. Okay, and then I just like set the goblin back down. All right. Nice. So now you're all just kind of sitting here. There's a goblin writhing in pain because it just had its arms dislocated and then relocated. Um, I check my backpack to make sure that I'm not missing anything. Everything's there. Okay. Um, am I allowed to scan the area again? Yes, go right ahead. Investigation. Can I investigate? Uh, yeah, you can investigate if you want. Alright, so, you managed to find a canoe by a river in the cave. I, I can't see this, so you, only you know. Wait, it's a what in a cave? It's like a canoe that goes to a river in a cave. Um, I walk toward the canoe silently. Alright, you walk towards the canoe. It is a very nice canoe. It is made out of a wood you do not recognize. Normally for, um, like, what wood does it look similar to? It doesn't look similar to any wood you've seen. What color is it? It's white. Okay. Yeah. If she's not giving you specifics about it, you're not gonna find Yeah, I don't think you're gonna find out very easily. Like I mean, I like to roll with Look, it. you never know what might be important. Yeah, that's true. You can't if roll. it was important, she would tell you. Um, I hop into the canoe. Uh, are there any oars? Uh, there's no oars in here. Hang on, you know what I should have asked? Um, what? is the canoe in any water? Uh, it's just on the ground. It is next to the water. Okay. Yeah. I get back out of the canoe. Uh-huh. Push it in the water and hold it so that it doesn't just go. Yeah, okay, you do that. So now you're holding onto a canoe. Hey, nerds! Go over here! I walk she over. She turns her head like how... She turns her head around and flies over. Alright. So now you're all surrounding this canoe. I'm... Get in the uh, canoe. Or has, has his, uh, yeah, I, I get in the canoe. Yet. Um, so, out of character, I thought Azzy was just gonna leave us behind. Yeah, same. I was thinking about it. Uh, I could tell. You suddenly notice that this canoe can only hold two people at once. However, connected to it is a rope with a barrel on the end of it. I have a question. Yeah. Um. What would happen if someone sat on another person's lap entirely to fit everyone in the canoe? I can fly. I mean, you, know? you could do that. That's true. I volunteer to be the one, quote unquote, to be in the barrel. All right. Uh, and I'm guessing Versus and Durkin go in the canoe, and yep, Avora goes towards the barrel. Yep. So I know with a canoe, like the heavier person has to sit. I forget if it's the back or the front. I most think the heavier person has to sit in the back. Okay, so are you sitting in the back right now? I'm 100% sitting in the front. Okay. Yeah. So I'll sit in the back. All because right. I'm like... Hang on, actually, let me check. Purely out of character, I'm 82 pounds. 
37 kilograms. Damn. Out of character, I think, I think I'm like, uh, I am like 20 kilograms lighter than you. Ow. I cannot so, when I asked if you were sitting in the back, I meant like before I got in. Because you were sitting in. No, I think no, I would have been sitting in the front. Yeah. Okay. Ask, ask me, I'm a fucking bird. Yeah. Bird. Oh. Um. So I'm guessing we're all just gonna like get in the boat and let it take the current wherever. Yeah. yeah. Yep. Alrighty, alrighty. Wonderful, wonderful. Oh no, I'm scared now. I should really get some dice. You should. Dice goblin. I dice have goblin. like game board dice. Like, board, board game. Why is it game board? Yeah. Yeah, I have the game like D6, but I don't have any like special ones. That changes into the music of the friendly tales. So I'm guessing we're ending at 3.30, right? Yep, 3, 3.30. Um, alright. So, you all start riding down the river, and, uh, roll me an investigation check, all three of you. Oh. Yeah. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh. Okay. So, um, versus... And Alvora, you both notice that the sides of the cave are not natural. In fact, they're, they're like made of rock. They're made of rock and they're made of stone. However, they're etched with various designs. Uh, um, do any of us know the design? Yeah. Uh, they appear to just be like historical figures. How old do the carvings look? Uh, they look about 200 years old. Do I recognize any of the figures on the... <laughs> on the etchings? Uh, no, you do not. Don't even need the roll history for that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You just don't. These That's are all vicious. old people. Uh, all three of you notice a light at the end of the river. She flies over first to see, to see if that's dangerous or not. Alright, and I have to change my music again. <laughs> yeah. I got scout brain on the mind. I mean, to be sure, Avora did do scouting a bit before, so. Yeah. Um, now, hold on, the clock is at the wrong one. All right. So you find yourself in a cylindrical room with a spiral staircase in the center. There are bookshelves everywhere. Do I recognize this place? Uh, no. This place appears to be very old. Is this the funny library? No. If funny it was, library. I would recognize that. That's true. Yeah, if it was the Grand Library, they would know it's there. Also, the Grand uh, Library is of the... infinite size. I, um... Can I check if I can hear any movements or noises? I roll an investigation. Oh. Uh, you do not hear anything. Hmm. The I water goes into, into a 
waterfall that goes into a fountain inside of the room. I fly back to the still approaching canoe, I believe. I believe. Yeah, it's still approaching. And, and tell them of the of the spiral staircase room. All right. Uh, do Durkin or Versus do anything about this information? I mean, we can't really. We're still approaching. Yeah, you're still in the canoe. Yeah. Like, what am I gonna do? Paddle with my hands? You could. Could. I mean, yeah, but there's really no point. Right. Uh... Well, that's. I, I'm. I'm just saying. There's something. There's something interesting over here. I'm not saying you need to do anything about. I guess we just wait. All right. I lined back in a barrel. Nice. I. Hold on, just. Alright. So. The boat slowly makes it there. And you all find yourselves. Is this the size of the boat? No, this is the room. Oh, okay. I was yeah. like, oh. And oh, let me get my pen out real quick so I can just draw a few things real quick. So that's the stairs there. Then there's bookshelf here. Bookshelf here. Bookshelf here. And then there's a fountain that and where did we enter from? Right here. Where I'm drawing right now. Oh, we entered from the fountain. Okay. Yeah. So, um, does the staircase go up or down? What? The staircase, does it go up or oh, down? Oh, it goes up. Okay. I pick up one of the books. Uh, Alright. Can I read anything from it? I... You cannot... Wait, hold on. What languages do you know? Uh, I believe Common and Elven. Alright. Uh, you, in fact, cannot read what is in this. Can, Can I try to read the language? book? I... Oh. oh, whoa, we got a person in the chat. What was that, Azzy? I couldn't hear you. Uh, can I try to read the book? Yeah, go for it. What language do you know? I know common and draconic. Okay, um... You cannot read it either. Do we know what language it's in? Uh, roll me a arcana check. Can I roll as well? Yes. Can I also roll? Yes. Anyone who looked at the book oh, may roll. Oh, dang, okay. Damn, so okay. Versus does not understand it. Alvora thinks it's Elvish and then translates it to a completely different message than what it actually translates to. On the other hand, as if a light bulb goes on in Durkin's mind, he suddenly understands the text perfectly. What does it say? Uh, it is a manual on how to use a machine. What yeah. kind of machine? Uh, roll me a intelligence saving throw. Intelligent. Oh, so is that like the top one? Or is yeah. that... Yeah. I think it's that. Yep. Uh, so you managed to figure out that this machine is not something that is mechanical. It is something beyond anything that you could possibly fathom to understand. Ooh. Yeah. Do I know, like, what it's for or how it works? Uh, you know neither of those things. Mm. All you're able to capture to is that it requires a wizard to be used. Okay, I put it in my bag because... I probably yeah. understand at this point that it's probably very useful. Yeah. Alright, so if you can add that to your inventory and you're all good. Uh... 
I look around, just, like, picking up random books, glancing at them, until something, like, catches my eye. I... You managed to find a book in a completely different language. That I can't understand or That you cannot language. understand. Um, can I try? Sure. I just have to roll a con and check again. Yep. <laughs> yep. I... Uh, this you have seen in the library once before. Um... This is an ancient language that was used by wizards to communicate with other wizards. But it's not elven, it's a wizard language. So, I'm just curious, what message did Alvora, um, get from the book? Uh, they got a cooking recipe. <laughs> for scrambled <laughs> eggs. Would it have been a good recipe? No. It is. It would it have is, been like absolutely like abhorrent. Fucking, fucking uh, cooking. Yeah, it would have been like eggs with like chili powder on it. Eggs of misery and salt. Oh yikes! Yeah. Um, so I guess I I keep picking up books and all right. looking at them, and if I don't understand it, I put it back, and I keep doing that until more stuff pops up that I can't understand. All right. I. And also, just so you know, uh, I'm just loading up the bio right now, so I can see what languages I know. Yeah. I don't know why it's taking so long. Oh, are you in bio and info? It doesn't show yeah. up. Yeah, that's oh, GM only. I, I gotta, oh, I gotta yeah, go to bio, okay. It's in your, yeah. yeah. It's actually in core. Okay. At the oh, bottom. Okay. Uh, yeah. So, uh, you eventually do uh, find, absorbent. you eventually do find a book that you understand. Okay. It is a scroll. And it is written in Undercommon, which the instructions were also written in Undercommon. And through the information given on it, you can tell it's some kind of spell that will heal someone. So now you can, right in my yeah, bag. you can use it once. Yeah. I fly so up it... the spell staircase. All right. Is that for like, if they're hurt, I can heal them, or like if they're dead, I can. Uh, if they're hurt. Okay. Yeah. Alvora um, flies I'm up, and sure that... oh, sorry. you can go ahead, Azzy. Um, can I go up about halfway up the staircase and just kind of read, like, the spines of the books? Sure, you can do that. Uh, what about you, Zach? What were you saying? Um, so, shoot, hold on. Uh, I'm pretty sure that potion that Pirate used on me, I was dead. Yeah, that was a healer's kit, which me is meant to, it doesn't revive someone, it stabilizes them. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, so instead of doing the yeah. saving throw, it just kind of... It just kind of okay, fixes so you up. For most purposes, this scroll will, quote, yeah. quote, bring someone back to life. Yeah. Okay. Uh, you read the spines of the books. They all appear to be numbered. That is all you can tell. Can I just pick one at random and see if I can read it? Sure. Uh, roll me a d100. Um... Let's give it a look and see. Alright, um... This appears to be some kind of potion recipe. You can tell because of the imagery of cauldrons throughout it not what the recipe is. Yeah, you cannot tell what the recipe is. Hmm. Uh, can I pick a different book? Uh, sure. Roll another one. D100. Uh, you pick up another book. It is a empty journal. 
just an empty journal. Yeah, an empty journal. Can I do it again? Uh, sure. I'm gonna keep doing that. Dang! Okay. Uh, okay. You managed to find a actually translated piece of a potion recipe. Oh. Yeah. What's the potion do? Uh, it is a potion of healing. Nice. Yeah. Um, can I stuff that in my bag? Yep, go right ahead. Take How much that way? Uh, I would say one pound if it's a small book. Uh, Why did chat just say author died? Oh, like for the empty time? journal, empty journal. Oh, oh, oh yeah, maybe. Oh, yeah. yeah. Um. So, you, Elvora, you make it to the second floor. There appears to be some kind of mechanism that's keeping the roof shut. There is a very large machine in here. Which looks incredibly peculiar. Um, can I try to understand it without any um, checks? Yep, Arcana check. No. Uh, is there anything else in the room? Uh, there's a few symbols on the floor next to the machine. Guess what it is? I. Uh, no. She sits up here for a bit, waiting for the other two to uh, wander up here. Alright. Uh, back to the both of you. What are you both doing? Uh, I guess I go up the spiral staircase to see what's up there. You see a very oh, familiar cool. machine. It is the machine from the book. Ooh. Yeah. Um. You know that it is used in part of a summoning circle. And. Do I know if it's used for evil or good things? It can be used for either of the two. It's just okay. for summoning in general. But you know that if the sunlight hits it, it activates. Can I tell what it's going to summon? Like, is there like some setting on the machine that you can put some uh, particular no. things? It looks like it just fires something into a very, very small pinhole. Hmm. Um, can I see what, um, uh, what opens the roof? Or am I just completely in that? Um, uh, roll an investigation. I am completely in that. Uh, you have no fucking idea. The roof fit looks like a roof. All she can do is just point at the roof and and point the that there is a seam in the roof, right? Yeah, there's a seam in the roof. Several seams in the roof. It almost makes a All spiral. Right, I I look up and just try uh, to find yeah. out what's going on. You Hold see on, it. I'm, Roll me yeah, in. I'm in the I mean yeah, I'm yeah. in four or I was in bio. Okay. Roll what? Investigation. Investigation. Okay. Oh. You have no fucking idea what that does. We both rolled the same. Can yeah. I, can I also roll an investigation? Go for it. Better not get a three. Oh no. Okay. <laughs> um. Literally the highest possible roll. Yeah. 
So, you take one glance at the ceiling and you immediately understand that a hand gesture will unlock it. Do I know what hand gesture? Yes. Can I... Maybe I should wait, never mind. You could bring it up with the rest of us, so we could make a decision together. That's true. I think if I do a hand gesture, it'll open. Hmm. Yeah, but if we do she that... She still has no summon... idea what the machine does, because yeah. someone didn't say it. Yeah. That could be a good idea, but also we don't know what it would summon. It, it summons things? Yeah, I read it in that book there that I understood. It's pretty neat. Seems completely I, magic to me, but... I thought that was Elvin. I, I genuinely... No, oh. <laughs> that, that was Azzy, not you. No, no, I was, I was what? saying... Azzy no, thought it was Elvin. Think, no, that was... No, that was... No, no, you yeah, did. no, that, that was... Elvin. Yeah, that was Evie that thought it was Elvin. I, and I thought oh. it was an everything for scrambled eggs. Oh! Yeah. I'm stupid. We know, it's okay. Because I, I don't... Yeah. Okay. Hmm. So, there is a chance we could summon something very bad, but also a chance we could summon something good. Either way, Evil. we don't... We can't really get out of here of... Um... Yeah, that already. is true. This might be our only way to get out. Alright, let's do it. Alright. Uh, can I do the hand gesture? Yes, you can. Uh, hmm. You do the hand gesture. It's a bit uncomfortable for your paws. However, after doing it, the roof starts to open up in a kind of spirally pattern. The sun beams uh, I down. Hold... I hold my bow. All right. Just in case. Oh, uh, you I hold your bow. All right. Stairs start to slide out from the wall, making a spiral staircase that goes up to the surface. And a beam of light shoots down into the machine. It seems to go through a few weird complex processes, and then a very, very concentrated beam of light shoots out of the end. And into the pit hole. That's it. Oh, it doesn't summon anything? Oh. It summons the light. Oh, I swear from that book it said it would summon something. Maybe it was wrong? Or maybe the machine isn't working. Either way, it was probably for the best. Alright, let's get out of here. Alright. Yeah, I put away my sword. You all start your walk up the spiral staircase, and you eventually find yourself at a very small cabin. There's a hole Mind in the roof that the goes right into the hole. What is that? I peeped outside the cabin. Uh, it's, anything, it's the woods. It's the woods sign for you. Um, is there anything else inside the cabin? Is there anything at all, actually? Nah. It's just like a wood cabin with a staircase that goes down. And a hole that goes into the machine. I exit the cabin. Alright. Um, does anyone else exit I the also... cabin? Alright. I will also exit the cabin. And Durkin? Yeah, I also. Yeah, alright. Gotta change my music then. In any case. I think we still might have a chatter. I'm not sure. I think so. Um. 
you all find yourself in the forest. The orcs are very close by. In fact, they're like a kilometer away, and you can see them over the treetop. I guess it's a smooth path to the orcs, at least. <laughs> Well, scenic doesn't really sound doesn't really sound right, but it's the closest one I can say. Can can I tell if they're bad or good? The orcs are very evil. Oh, okay. In fact, it's kind of Great. like a thing you were told yesterday that you had to go fight the orcs to bring peace back to the village. Alas, you were asleep. Yeah, you were asleep though, so you didn't get to hear it. I accidentally just did something that's. Yeah. Before. Yeah, you did a lore I genuinely forgot. Yeah. But also, I shouldn't have known anyways. So I guess now I know they're evil. Yep. Oh, huh. that's the that's the place we're supposed to investigate. Oh, we're supposed to investigate that? I was about to sneak around. I don't want to mess with that stuff. They're evil. We're going to be going to both. Okay. She tries to silently fly up to see, uh, see what the orcs are doing. Uh, I know what it is. You know. They are celebrating. How many orcs can I see? Right now, there are about five orcs there. She flies back down under the, uh, under the trees and tells them that. Tells the entire party there's five orcs in there. And heavily distracted. That's that's all <laughs> that's all I'm gonna say. Alright. Um Where are the other two? There we go. Uh, you ready your sword? The... I'm guessing you're not gonna go for it? Yeah. Alright. Sure. To be fair, I wasn't. I wasn't gonna, but it's... Uh, <laughs> if the dwarves goes, I go. Why not? You find yourself at the edge of the orc camp. There is a very large wooden wall between you and the orcs. How thick is the wall? It is made of log. Okay, very um, thick. Can I, 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 can I fly to at least a ledge that I can grab onto? Uh, yeah, you can do that. I'm gonna have to roll a stealth roll. I... Okay, stealth roll, stealth roll, stealth roll. Yeah. Work. Dang, okay. I'm very sneaky. Yeah, okay. Um, do you manage to sneak your way onto a guard tower very easily? There's no one here. I position myself to be able to see every single orc uh, that I can. And All pull right. my bow. You and pull out your bow. Doing that. I'm going to look for a crack in the wall that I could squeeze through. If not, I'll just use the front entrance. Yeah. Can I try to? Can I try to join Elvora in the guard tower? Oh, uh, you can try. It's Jerkin. It's so, these two. Are in the guard would that be tower. acrobatics or would that be? Stealth? Acrobatics and then stealth. Because you can't fly. Jesus Christ. Yeah. That's me searching for a yeah. crack in the wall. Still. Nice. Mm. Uh, you managed to get up. You're a little bit loud, but you managed to very beautifully just kind of like climb your way up like a cat. You can um, do it. You can do it. You're without the fucking... Dirk it. You do not so find a... Really you do not find a crack, however, you do find a small hole that goes underneath the logs. Alright, I sneak through there. Alright. Oh, let me 
do some drawing real quick just so I can like Here's the guard tower. And then they have that. And there, hold on. I wish the map was bigger. Yeah. We'll be getting rid of those soon, don't worry. Okay, so you're right here, Durkin. We really gotta get you off okay. of, like, tokens. Um, maybe put down those orcs along with any cover. So they have some, like, logs lying right here. And there's... I get behind the logs. Yeah. There's, like, a building here. I assume the orcs is like out uh out about how do I ping? Uh you just hold down click. Like about here. Yeah. And then I'll uh, I'll toss down like orcs. Free the orc! Free the orc! Yeah. So I can't see two of them, at least. Yeah, you can see, uh, you can see these three that are right here, here, and here. I do remember them standing there because, like, I already saw the entire layout. Yeah. Um, she, uh, gestures to the, gestures to the, uh, Vulcan, t uh, next to her and points at the points at the space behind the uh the building. That's like right here. There's two orcs there. Yeah, here. Alright. So you can see right, these guys? Know. Yeah. Well okay. I could I could, so, but like it, yeah, they're I don't know if they, uh, exactly they're here. Okay. So Evie can't see them and I can't see them, so we don't know they're there. Yeah. Evie knows they're there. Okay. Yeah. So I try to sneak like right here and get behind this wall. Kind of like right there. Okay. I don't know if stealth. I need to make any roll. Yeah, yeah, I have okay. a stealth. I, I only told I only uh, told Asby that. Okay, so as Durgan's around here, they trip and fall over. Great. Um, they are now prone, and this orc right here is now alert to your presence. Okay. Uh, I try to, I try to as fast as possible take, uh, take out the orc. Alright, one moment. Uh, sneaky, it's a sneak attack. Yeah. You could probably just bow them down. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. Nice. Yes. Alright, so yeah, give me a roll. roll what do I roll? It, the, the roll for bow. Oh, yeah, yeah you roll for bow. Six, eight, fourteen. Sorry, I just said. Yeah. Okay, shoot. Yeah. Uh, alright, you deal four damage. How much damage do they have? Uh, I can't tell you that. Anyways, oh, okay. um... Yeah. So they're so, not dead. Yeah, they're not dead. Okay. Uh, roll for initiative. Yeah, that's kind of what I meant to ask, is just, are they dead? Yeah. Uh, Zach, roll for initiative. Oh, okay. Yeah. Is uh, Azzy still in stealth? Yeah, Azzy is, is still in stealth. Pop? Yes, it's group. A, no, oh, it's uh, completely separated. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Why can't I find initiative? It's weird. Next to your armor class. Yeah, it's actually your armor class. It's like close to the top, like right over your hit oh, points. Oh yeah 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 okay. Yeah. Should have known 
for that I have I don't have my full health. Can't do spell. Oh gosh, this is. Oh, there we go. That's a that's a button next under it. There. Yeah, there you go. All right. So, it is now Durkin's turn. Okay. Um. You're so still on the floor, buddy. I try to go here. Okay. Try to get yeah. More cover. Well, prone, yeah. you can do that. So. Uh, you're now against the wall. You're still laying on the floor. Yeah, I get up now. All right. And then, anything else, or will that be all? Uh, yeah. Is is this orc here, tr like, gonna try to chase me? Yeah, they know you're there because you tripped and you fell and you made a loud yeah, noise. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna, like, go to here. I'm okay. just walking, so I don't think that needs any kind of like. Yeah, it doesn't need any roll. And then I'm gonna wait for the orc to turn the corner and slice him. Okay. I'm guessing that's end turn. Yeah. All right. Um. Da, 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 uh, okay, they're gonna make an attack against you. Oh wait, I thought I was I was gonna like nope. sneak attack. Nope. Uh. -uh. You can't sneak attack so when he knows you're there. Oh, yeah. Went loud. Yeah, let's see. Plus five, so that's 16. Uh, what is your armor class, Zach? My armor class is 14. Alright, so that is a hit. Uh oh. Alright, so oh. they bring their great axe down and uh, they manage to scratch you pretty badly with it. You take seven damage. Okay, now I can try to like. Yeah, now it's I actually Evie's plunge turn. Plunge my sword into his chest. It's Evie's turn yeah. first. Um, I oh, aim wait. at the uh, I aim at the orc that is targeting the door. All right, go for it. And do 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 do. That is a hit. I'll count. Can I join in on the fight? Yes, you may. Roll for initiative. All right, so I think, I think that yeah, I think the fucking orc's dead. Nope, not uh, not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Uh, it is now Versus' turn. Okay, can I uh try to hit that orc with my bow? Yeah, go for it. Roll for your bow attack. Go. You mean go? What? You gotta what? do the attack first. That's the damage. Oh shit! Yeah. Like the my Where the fuck is that? I'm stupid. Uh. Okay. So. Hold on. Okay. 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 Cool. But I think you just click on the name of the item you're using. I think you would just. Yeah. There you go. Okay. That is a hit. Uh. So now you just click on the word shortbow in the chat window, and it'll do the damage. All right, and with that, the orc falls to the ground, lifeless. Uh, I'm not upset about this, but I thought like, if the orc knew I was here and I went into cover and like hid, I mean they know you're around, so they're not gonna like lower their yeah, guard. That's true. Yeah. Anyways, it is now your turn, Zach. If you would like to do anything. All right. Yeah. Yeah. I just go back to here. Because I'm going to try to strategize to get that orc right there. Okay, go for it. Uh, so that is end of combat, I suppose? And yeah. it just goes to, like, back to stealth. All right. Oh, wait, back you didn't self. subtract my health. <laughs> I thought I'm, you were going to do that I'm yourself. I'm surprised that... Oh, I'm yeah. Surprised oh, what's my health? The other... I'll do it for you. Okay, thanks. I, I'm surprised that the, the other two orcs did not notice that one of my has gone missing. Orcs are not particularly intelligent. Um. So, you're back to stealthing. What would you like to do? Hmm. Oh, I. Hmm. I 
I try to pick up a stone uh -huh. and throw it like this way to try to get the orc's attention. All right. So their guard is still low-ish, but yeah, roll an acrobatics. Yeah, I'm trying to like get them to come to me for guidance. Okay. All right, we successfully managed to do that, and the orc goes to check it out. So I am hiding behind this wall, right? The orc can't yep. see me. Okay. Uh, yeah, you're hidden. You know, I kind of thought the orc would, like, see the direction it was thrown and kind of walk that way. I guess no, they just check it at the rock. No, they're very Orcs stupid. are not very, very intelligent. <laughs> okay, so I pick up another rock and I throw it at this ball. Okay, roll for, uh, roll for acrobatics again. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Um, you actually throw it over, like, here. And, uh, oh, oh no, they don't see it. They just got it. Okay. Oh. Uh, just uh, got uh, 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 nope. Okay. No, I don't another it. rock and throw it. This guy saw it. There's Hold a... on. Oh, this guy, this guy saw it. Okay. Yeah. And now I stab him. All right. Right when he gets up roll to for the roll for attack. All right. Oh wait, I have a spear. I thought I had a sword. Yeah. Okay, well. Yeah, spear, sword, chain of tomato. Um, alright. Very nice. I shoot at the- I shoot at the orc. Okay. Then, uh, he goes for some, I think. Seven. Five. Alright. Um. You miss Alvora. And you only managed to. Fire my arrows again. Yeah. Uh, roll for initiative again. For combat against orc. Ooh, I'm not doing good right now. Yeah. That is you too, Zach. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, you're in the combat. Can I. Yeah. Can I also join in again? Yeah, roll for initiative. I mean, to be fair, you have self. You have self. We no longer have self. Yeah, okay. Uh, Derosus oh, no, gets to go first. Go. Oh. Um, yeah, I'll use my bow. Alright, roll for your attack. That is a hit. You can go ahead with the damage. And with that, the orc is dead. Damn. Yeah. Derosus really being the um, fucking MVP of this mission. I tried to. I try to gesture at um, the dwarf to pick up the arrows, but not very effectively. Do I pick up on the signals? Roll for intelligence. Oh, I meant like if Evie was good enough at. Oh yeah, uh, Evie signals. roll charisma. Zach roll intelligence. Okay. Uh no. We're fucking stupid. Uh. Elvora just finds signals, but you don't know what the hell they're talking about. Okay. Yeah. So, I, I guess I walk here. I All don't right. think I have to roll, because I'm just walking like normal. Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. I'm going to try to get this orc to me. Okay. You're you're I out of sight line. Okay, I pick I, up. You don't know that, but you're out of sight line. Oh, so I can't see it. Uh, right. I think you can see it because you're around the corner, but like, yeah, Evie okay. and Azzy can't see you, or the work. Okay. So, I try a weird maneuver, which uh -huh. is picking up a stone, throwing it here, and then running like behind this wall here. Okay, so roll two wait, acrobatics checks. Okay. Jesus Christ, okay. So, 
you toss a rock and very quickly kind of do like a sprint behind the wall. And does it see me? No. Awesome. So now it's in the same position as that other orc. So I pick up another rock and throw it here. Okay. Roll for That's acrobatic. So the fucking arrows, by the way. All right. What are you doing, bro? Like, but I don't know that you need the arrows. And then when it comes around the corner, same thing. Stab it. In the chest. All right. Roll for the damage. Ooh, uh, that would. Oh. I did. No. 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 Oh. Oh, yeah, no, so that would be strength, right? Yeah, that would be that. That would be axe or, no, no, or spear. Yeah, yeah that... it's roll for spear. Yeah. That is a miss. Oh, I shoot. All right, take a shot. Good shoot. All right, you can do the damage. Ooh. Oh. Yeah, that's what I thought. Can I try to run can away? I shoot. Uh, yeah, you can go for a shot. Uh, that is a hit. Go ahead. All right. Uh, everyone roll for initiative. It's combat time. Oh, we are very good at. Oh no! Right now. All right. So Durkin gets to go first. Okay. So can I hit him again? Yeah, you can go right ahead. Okay. Oh. That is a miss. It is now a uh, versus turn. Okay. That is a miss. You need an arrow. Ah. Oh no. It is now Alvora's turn. Okay. Let me decrease my arrow for four I got. Yeah. Yeah, I'm at I'm at six. That is Again? a hit. Very nice. Oh. That's a grace. Yeah. Um uh, then. Can I try to run away? Uh, is that your turn anymore? Your face. Yeah. Oh, right. The orc shouts really loud. A war cry. Right. Yeah. And then he runs off over here. Okay, so at least I'm not dead. Oh, I have a really but funny I, idea. I probably will be. Yeah. I want to run it by you. Okay. What would the consequences for the orcs be if they slipped on 1,000 ball bearings? They would be prone? Are you... Are you gonna fucking mm -hmm. ball bearing them? If I ball bearing them... That's not... Uh, mods ban that motherfucker. Yeah, mods ban that guy. War? So, if they're prone, I oh. could probably get a better hit on them with my sword, right? Hold on. Mods, get this guy, please. And this is this is Ban this guy. There we go. Bang. All right. So wait, what did he say? It was a scam thing. Uh. Yeah. It was like cheap viewers. Yeah, cheap viewers at this website. Uh. Yeah. So it's like botting the stream, which is awful. Yeah. yeah. All right. So it is now Durkin's turn. Yeah. So if the orcs are prone, could I have an advantage? For stabbing them with my spear. Uh, you could, but they're not prone right now. Well, yeah, but if as yeah. he does the ball bearing thing, ball if bearing. I do the ball bearing thing, yeah. Or yeah, Alvora. No, not I, Alvora. I, no, wait. Versus. Ah, Versus. 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 Sus. Wait, it's my turn. No, it is Durgan's turn. It is Durgan's turn. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, Do your move. Hmm. Yeah. I try to run and hide behind here. 
Okay. good oh, okay. uh however due to the fact that you were moving right next to the enemy and you moved while next to the enemy uh they get a advantage attack against you well wouldn't i know they saw me so my guard they already be saw you oh, and it's less yeah, about the guard fun? being up okay so here's the thing right uh, like yeah. if you went here you would have only had one tile of contact. But because you went here, you kind of were like in their face, and then you ran while in their face. Uh, so they can attack, but yeah. Uh, okay. Uh, you take 12 damage. Wait. Yeah. Oh. Well. Uh... Durkin is now incapacitated. It is now Versu's turn. I... Okay. Um, I shoot the orc with the bow. Which orc? Which one? There's two in the yeah, side. The one that attacked Zach. Oh, okay. Yeah, go for it. Alright, that is a hit. You can go for the damage. Alright, five. Hold on, let me do some I... math. Me, me, me. There it Not yet. There is a chance. It is now. It is now Evie's turn. Go ahead, Alzora. Do your um, thing. I poke it. I poke it versus and suggest a plan. I, I fly into the air and I, and I run distraction. I like that idea. Go for it. Um, I fly out of the guard tower, scre uh, bird screeching. Alright, I'm just gonna figure out what this is, yeah. I'm not dead yet. Yeah, you're not dead I'm just yet. I'm like, about, I fly out to go about here. Okay. So I assume you're still airborne? Yes, completely right. airborne. Yeah. Alright. Uh, so, both of these come over here. And one of them throws a javelin towards you. I'm running and it misses. And it is now Durkin's turn. Roll for a uh, death save. To that, I'm not doomed because I can still roll for death save and yeah. get healed by potions. So I can still live. It's not over for me. Yeah, it's not over yet. Death save. It's over for you. Um, with, um, oh, really? That with, is a uh, fail. Well, okay. I, get, I get three. Yeah, I get three. Yeah, it is now Thirsty's uh, turn. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna, gonna short bow. Okay. okay, I'm gonna short bow the closer one. All right, go for it. That is a hit. Four. All right. They look pretty heavily wounded, and they're starting to look kind of like a porcupine, but they're still up and running. Um, it is now Alvora's turn. I circle around the orcs uh, while pointing at the at the door. Like <clears throat> I'm doing invasive maneuvers in the air. What? You're gonna have to word that a little bit better. I what? Yeah, I didn't even okay. understand. Yeah. You're pointing at the door for going in circles? What? I I'm pointing at I, I'm pointing while doing essentially this. Okay. Okay. I, I don't All right. understand. So I, you're circling. I'm trying to tell Abby to get you. Oh. Okay, roll a charisma check. And then, uh, Versus, roll an intelligence check. I don't think it's okay. needed. No, it might still happen. No. no. Okay, you don't understand what Alvora is doing. 
and now I do another death save, I'm guessing. Yep, death save. Uh, that is another failed death save. Oh, great. I have good. one more shot. If yeah. I fail this shot, I'm dead. Uh, Versus, it is now your turn, and you can see that Durkin is on the verge of death. Um... I suppose I hop down from the tower. You suppose? All right. Dang. All right, so roll me a medicine check. Sigh. All you right. You seem very enthusiastic at saving me. So that I'm is... I'm talking about. That is a success. Yay, I'm alive! No. Shut up. Oh. Not yet. Not you need yet. three successes to come back, and you need three failures to be dead. Oh, right. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Um, it is now Elvora's turn. I continue to try and distract the orcs. Drawing okay. the attention away from the saving. Alright. And one of them throws a javelin. But it exactly misses. Right and another one throws a javelin. And what is your armor class? The armor class 12. Alright, and that is a hit. Uh oh. Yep. Uh oh, great. Yeah. Uh, four damage. I'm still alive. That's a surprise. Um,. It is now your turn, Durkin. I'm just gonna move back out there because they're, you know, chasing the pretty birdie. So I'm guessing I have to do a death save. Yeah, you have to do a death save. Oh yes! All right, oh. very nice. Oh. Okay. That was the tensest thing oh, like ever. So you just need two more of those. Nope, one more. No, just one more. Medicine oh, checks more. over ten give a success. Oh, yeah, very nice. So it is now your turn, Versus. Come on, Versus. I'm actually okay. lightheaded right now. Oh. There's two choices. Yeah. You can either help your dwarf I friend. Can either... Or you I can, can like... either bank on a successful death save. Here, I'm or... gonna send you a screenshot. I want you to show bow. the stream this. Yeah, will do. This is me. Yeah, let me open that up. Mm, I'll do medicine save. Yay. Uh, <laughs> so if I get one more failure, I die forever. All right. But if I get live, one more live. success, I yep. live. Yep. Oh, I live? Yep, you live. Yes. Although you were still incapacitated, but you are alive. I mean, yeah. Okay. I am so I lived. Here. Derkin lives to fight another battle. Alright. So, um, it is now, uh, Elvora's turn. I try to fly back into the tower. Alright. It's a distance of 25, so, yep, throw it ahead. Anything else? I land, and, uh, can I shoot still? Yes, you can. I aim the orc closest to me. All right. Like, this, go for damage. This dude. Yeah, go for damage. We will go for attack. Uh, oh. you miss. Time to go decrease my arrows again. Yep. That's, um. <laughs> that's not what I was going to. As for the orcs, um, they both go for a regrouping. Uh, it is now not Durkin's turn, because Durkin's yeah, asleep. Alive, yeah. um, it is now Versus' turn. Go ahead. Do your thing. Okay. Um, I'm gonna do a funny like strafe over here. Uh-huh. Go and for it. Shoot. Uh, which one is the one that's like more damaged again? Uh, that would be this one. You can't see cool. that one. Can you? Can I? 
You can see it. Gotcha. Mm. Okay. In that case, I'm gonna do a funny that thing. All right, that is a hit. Ooh. Go right ahead. And with that, the orc falls to the oh. ground lifeless. Yay! Yippee! So I probably should have told y'all this, but you probably could have taken a health file out of my backpack. Yeah, probably. Saved all the defense situation. Sure, but I feel like that's probably better used than like. In even more dire circumstance. That's true. Like, it I... almost was a more dire That's true. That is true. I was one <laughs> roll away from permanent death. Yeah, but you can just make another character. That's a little bit fucked up. Dang. Damn. Wow. Okay. Fucked up. Wow. All of the character development Durkin has gone through so far, which is not much, but you know, it's still there. I mean, with the lore. Yeah, with the lore. There's a lot of lore. <laughs> All right. Is it? So, Who's turn? it is El Flora's turn. Yeah. I, uh, there is still a javelin inside of my stomach, right? Yeah, there's still a javelin inside of your stomach. I yanked that shit out. All right, you yanked that I shit out, and you have a javelin now, and you were also bleeding out. You didn't think about that. I'm I I'm going to fro uh how do I how do I roll a javelin frog? Uh roll a one d twenty in strength. So just like Yeah, it's your strength. So how long does she have before she bleeds out? Great. Uh, Great. All right. Roll me a constitution saving throw. Uh, so, from the perspective of Durkin and Venusus, you watch as Alvora pulls a javelin out of her stomach, gets ready to throw it, and then collapses onto the ground. Incapacitated? Incapacitated. They're just asleep for now. Oh, okay. Yeah. But going to die very soon, right? Like... Yeah, unless someone can tend to the bleeding. Am I conscious? Uh, you're conscious, but you're not very conscious. Like, you're able to crawl around. Okay. I hand Versus one of my... I... Uh, you're kind of far from Versus. One of my health... You just hold or, like, I hand. Try. Like 30, I'm, just, like, I'm like 30 feet over, away. Holding my hand out. Yeah. I, I don't know. This is your maximum speed you can go while crawling. Yeah, I guess. Wait, my how many shit my heroes kit? It has like a few uses, right? Yeah, 10 uses. You don't have it. Okay, yeah. I just slowly crawl over holding my hand out with the healing kit. Wait. Uh no, you, you do have Yeah, you do have two of kit. Okay. Um you're holding the healer's kit out in the direction of uh Versus. Okay, here's the here, out of character question. Yeah. Why are you trying to give it to me instead of doing it yourself? They I'm can't go up conscious. the wall. You're the so only I one that's actually like fully conscious, conscious right now. Okay. Also, I, I put suppose... in the kit nine, so we know that it's been used. Yeah. I suppose. I grab the kit and then try to go. Why back are up. you so unenthusiastic about All this? Alright, roll acrobatics. <sighs> Alright. And you are now at the top of the wall. And you can do anything you want. Yeah, I'm surprised you didn't hear my question. How conscious am I? And her response is not very. Yeah. All Durkin could do right now is like oh, crawl no. around and tremble. And I am Sam. not. Uh, you don't do no. a medicine check with the oh, yeah, healer's you kit. You just use it. Yeah, you just use it. Uh, you patch Alvora up and they stop bleeding. They will be active again in two turns.
And as for the Still orcs, standing. All right. so now I just slowly crawl behind this wall just yeah. to get some cover. All right, yeah, that works. And uh, it is now Versus' turn. What would you like to do? I guess I'll shoot the closer one. Yeah, go for it. Or at least try to. <laughs> That is a hit. Go ahead. It's rolling the fucking crit. Yeah, it's rolling the crit, so we're just gonna take that five. Um, well, if it's crit, then why not? Uh, that's for advantage. Okay, fair enough. Yeah. Um, it is now Albora's turn. Albora, you are half awake. You will have disadvantage on any roll you do. I pick up Reaver. I I am. All right. I'm not yeah. Gonna take a chance. Yeah, you're pretty safe up there. Yeah. Derek, on the other hand, is in the fucking lion's yeah. den. I'm I'm just getting flashbacks. Yeah. And you know what? The I'm war. gonna have that as part of my lore. I'm getting flashbacks. Yeah. So not only am I barely able to walk, I can't walk actually. Yeah. But also, I'm just like spiraling. Yeah. Oh. Um, it's the war again. It's the war again. So. I just realized that this stream was just showing gay baby jail for a while. Oops. That's kind of funny. Yeah. Um. All right. So. The. Oh, I oh, already no, had that's, a, that's not new. Yeah, no, that's yeah, not that new. That is not new. I've, I've always had PTSD. Yeah. Uh, one of the orcs moves over there. Other one over here. And it is so, now... I think out of the corner of my eye, I, I can see one. this one. Yeah, you so can see it. So I try them. to crawl just a little bit further that way. Alright. It is now uh, Versus' turn. That is a miss. It is now Alphora's turn. You are fully awake. Aiming at the aiming at the exact same orc. Um, versus All right. Versus yeah, go for it. That is a hit. Go on ahead. Very nice. And with that, an orc falls to the ground and dies. Only one left. Uh, so, the orc approaches the watchtower and pulls out his great axe before starting to hack away at the tower. However, he misses. It is now Derkin's turn. Oh, I'm like conscious? I'm uh, you're half conscious. So you okay. can do whatever, but I can't you're stumble over and try to slash. All right, you're gonna take the risk. All right, go for it. But yeah, you get disadvantage, gonna... so just keep that in mind. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. that is a miss. Oh no! Uh oh. Yeah, it is now Versus turn. Oh no. Not again. And that is a miss. It is not Alvora's turn. Not again. I can't oh, do this again. I... Oh, I'm I try to um <laughs> Don't try, dude. Yeah, you kinda got a dwarf on the line. That's it? That's a hit, yep. Alright. And the dwarf is still up. Or not the dwarf. The, uh, the oh. orc. Oh. Well, both of you are still oh. up, but you know. Okay, I'm gonna try to slash at it again. Just it is its no, turn. It's... I'm art. Oh, it's my it's turn? The orc's no, turn, right? it's the orc's yeah. turn. Oh, oh. And the dork, the orc makes a slash towards Durkin, but misses narrowly. Oh. Oh. It is now okay. Durkin's turn. I have to. I'm gonna slash at it again. Miss. 
Yeah. What do I need for it to hit? 13 and above. Oh. Yep. It is now Versus' turn. Shortbow! That is yeah. a hit. And with that, the orc falls to the ground, and the entire arena becomes silent. You have killed all of the orcs in I this guess. encampment. You know what's Yosu really Campbell. funny? So true. What's really funny? I took no, I took no damage during that entire thing, and both of you nearly died. Yeah. And you were so unenthusiastic. Oh, I guess I'll save you. I, I got guess. Out of, one. Out of character. We were dying. Out of character. I know. Out of character. Wait, out of character I'm unenthusiastic. In character. in character, I didn't say a single word. I just did shit. Yeah. So Why is it unenthusiastic? Why are you a lame out of character or in character? Yes, that was out of character. Why are you so unenthusiastic about saving your buddies? Damn. Yeah, that makes me feel worse. If it was yeah, I don't even know their name. Starts, like, it's you. That's a good point. I don't even. Um. The moon has Michael. risen, and the sky is dark. There is, however, a few lights throughout the camp. I just collapsed to the um, ground. Yeah. First. Because I'm still first, somewhat uh, in a spiral from my PTSD. Uh, first thing I do, I take I, I take my fucking arrows back. All right, you take your arrows back. You were all also very hungry. More. More. <laughs> well, the dwarf is um doing that um. Can I see if the, uh, if he's okay first, and then see if the orcs have anything on them? Yeah, you can go ahead. So what does, um, uh, can I roll with to try to comfort the dwarf? Yeah, go ahead, charisma roll. Oh, that's a, that's the one thing I'm already bad at. Yeah, go ahead. I. Uh, you don't manage to comfort them, but you don't discomfort them. They're just kind of, you know, the same. Um, I was just gonna take a while doing that then. Alright. Can I do it again? Yeah, go ahead. Alright. And with that, the dwarf is calm again. Um, you are all very hungry, and your bellies are rumbling. What's that building in the middle? Uh, it is a storage shed. Would it probably have food? Yeah. Can we raid it? <laughs> yeah. I still want to look through the orcs. Alright, uh, you look through the orcs. They all have great axes. And they all have hide armor. However, the armor is... A little bit out of your size. Not even money on them. Oh, well. Yeah. I try looking around for just anything that catches my eye. Maybe a hidden trap or yeah, roll investigation. a secret room or something. Investigation. Uh, you don't find anything. You forgot to, you forgot to make an entrance. For yeah, the that's fine. Little building. Um. So, Versus, as you enter the building, you see racks and racks. Some of them are filled with meat, others with bread, some with weapons, some with money. And there's a large chest at the end of the room. A chest? Yeah, a treasure chest. Uh, I am walking towards that building. I am not. In no position, fly. Yeah. I also realistically. Over. Yeah. Realistically, we all know what that chest is. Oh yeah, it's a trap chest for sure. But do our characters know that? Or it's no. a mimic. Oh yeah, that is probably 
corner line plate. Yeah, go ahead and run a uh, arcana check and see if it's a mimic. Let me. I'm a hundred percent gonna do that. Yeah. Can I roll it? Can I roll it? Appears to be a regular chest. Yes, you can roll. It is a normal chest. It is legitimately just a chest. Okay. Open well, also, chest. even if it wasn't, you would still have to open it, because that's what your character would do if you yeah. saw a regular chest. Uh, you open up the chest, and inside, do you see 50 gold pieces, along with a... It is a scrap of green cloth. Just that. <laughs> is it the exact same fucking um green that's in my dream, <laughs> quote unquote? Yeah. I pick it up and it's like, huh. Look at this green. Turn up those fryers, cause you're all hungry. There's also a campfire, so you can get, you can cook in the campfire I if take you want. a piece of meat, and I cook it over the campfire. Nice. You take a piece of meat, and you stick it on the end of your spear, and you cook it. Uh... Um, I take a piece of meat, take a bite out of it, it doesn't taste that great, so then I put it over the fire. Okay. Uh, both of you, roll me a survival check. Yeah, if you want to cook a meat. I'm cooking a what meat. are the chances of getting an infection from eating raw meat? Okay, here's the thing. I'm literally a wild animal. Eh, oh, yeah. that's not what it's for. Um, Dirk and Elvora both managed to cook things pretty well. Like, they're pretty nice little strips of meat. Versus, yeah, on I the didn't other take hand... A I still had to roll. Versus, on the other hand, somehow, with just meat and the fire, manages to create a exquisite meal. <coughs> um, you all have food now. Um, I eat the exquisite meal. I take all of the gold and put it in a pile so we can split it up evenly. How nice. many? How much fucking gold is in there? Fifty gold. Fifty. No, wait. No, it wasn't there some on the chest? chest, right? The chest has oh, fifty. Still, the rack still has money. Yeah, the rack still does have money. Yeah, um, so that's what I meant. Like, I took the gold from the chest and from the racks. In total, the pile, so there is seventy-five gold. I'm just gonna take some tea. Alright. So there's now 60 left. So then I guess I take 30. Alright. And I guess that leaves the. Uh, there's Seuss with 30. Remember to add that to your character sheets. Yep. Yeah. Uh, 30 more total or 30 add. more? 30 more. So you get 30. Durkin gets 30. Elvora gets 15. So you say, Gibby, go ahead. <coughs> what weapons are in the uh, sword shed? I lots of short swords and lots of great axes. Not a single extra arrow inside. Yeah. You do see a few bows, although they're all snapped. Misery. Yeah. Roll me a perception check, Elbora. Specifically, oh, Elbora. Oh. No one else gets to. That's a good one. One of these snapped bows resonates with you. It is a bow with a carving on it. The carving reminds you of something. 
I'll pick it up. I'll pick it up. I'll pick it up. All right. Uh, what? What does it? What does it remind me of? And what does it say? Uh, it is a message in Elvish of the town in which you were raised. This is a standard military bow used in that town. I am going to keep that. What is the bow? Is it a short bow or a long, long bow? Long bow, although it is broken. And you will need to get it mended. I have a bit of rope. Do you think I could fix it? Uh, you could try. No, no, I need to do it myself. But why? I mean, to be fair, like, if you try to fix it yourself, you could, like, end up breaking it worse. Uh, yeah. Okay. I... I... I know where this bow comes from. Comes from. I am not going to have its memory stolen by it breaking even more. By possibility, anyways. I'm not yeah. saying you're, you're going to break it, but... Yeah, I know. Oh, you're saying that in character? Yes. Yeah. Alright, that sounds fair. Um, I couldn't tell because he didn't have like a character voice. Yeah, yeah, they kind of do. Anyways, it is late and you were all sleepy, and now with very nice full bellies of savory meats. Bedroll. All right, Alvora pulls out her bedroll. Oh wait, yeah, let me see what I have. I don't have anything. Damn. Does Versus have a bedroll? What is the floor made out of? I might, uh... The floor outside is made out of mud, while the floor inside of the shed is wood with a rug. I sleep I'll sleep on, on the rug. rug. Oh. Alright, you both sleep I'm on the rug. The, the bedroll. Enemies to lovers. Uh, nuh uh. <laughs> um. So, do you not sleep on the rug and I get it for myself. No, I sleep on the rug. I push you off of it. Damn. Contested I athletics. You... Yeah, I'm I'm way stronger than you. <laughs> we'll see. Uh, okay. Oh wait, athletics, not strength? Yeah, athletics. Oh, I'm not I only have three instead of five. Alright, let's see uh versus athletics check. Chat, we are. This is definitely just a fucking. Or that's acrobatics. Yeah, that's acrobatics. That's We're doing athletics. Uh, okay. Laser gun. What? Oh my god! <laughs> um. You both get onto the rug and you start fighting a bit before Versus grabs Durkin and throws them through the wall. That's about right, that... yeah. That gets me up suddenly and- And uh... also, chat, just so you know, canonically, I weigh 173 pounds. Yeah. And I weigh like 80-something. So that was like, crazy. I am I, going to go I check I literally on... just said fuck off. And then yeah. made you. I'm going to go check on Durkin. That is a uh, bro. He looks very sore. I am still at one hit point as well. Yeah. <laughs> you could have killed him again. Are you gonna shoot, shoot him out? I'm going to help, uh. Help Dirk get back in the shed. Alright. What kind of comfy bedding will they can use? The Versus, which I don't actually know the name of. Why did you do that? Why? What? Huh? I. <laughs> Wasn't in that room. <laughs> I want you to know this rug is actually like really big. Oh. So that was like that's yeah, kind of a yeah. really funny comment to have. Just ask. Uh, 
I sigh and I go back to go back to my bedroll. All right. I swear I got an Abby Roy in my bedroll already. So is the, the, the bedroll from you? Well, that's that guy didn't hear you. Why are you so mean? Any I'm not mean. So I'm guessing you all can just fall asleep where you are. Easy time. Yep. Easy time. Alright. Uh, you all sleep. You get a long rest. So, uh, you know. Oh, long yeah. rest button. Yeah, long rest button. The long rest button. Hit the long rest button. Uh, and the morning has come. The sun is shining. One moment, I just gotta make some changes to the ambience. Do, do, do. I assume we should pack some bread before we go, right? Yeah, I think we should. That's probably a good idea. Bread. Um, How many loaves of bread are there? There are a copious amount of loaves of bread. I do not think you'll be able to hold all of them. What is I'll my three. capacity? I don't remember what your capacity is. But there are 300 breads. I take as many as I can stuff in my bag. Alright, so I'd say that's like 10 breads. Uh, I currently have 79.32. Um, yeah, I think you can just take like 10 breads before it becomes too large for your bag. Okay. Yeah. I forget what the limit is. Bread though, bag. Like, I'm a yeah, I don't remember either. Hmm. Um. So yeah, you can all carry like 10 breads at once if you want. I'm taking three. Alright. I will take five bread. Okay. Um, how how heavy is bread? One pound each. It's some heavy bread. And if you were all okay with it, I think this is a good place to end today's session. Yep. Okay. Okay. Yeah, bread. sounds good. Yeah. We all got tons of bread. Yeah, that was a good session. Also, that's a major compliment saying you're going to write a novel about this. That's cool. <laughs> love books. I love books. What loaf of bread is one whole pound? Pound cake. Uh. <laughs> Thank you, chat. Yeah, chat agrees. Pound cake. Also, a giant loaf of bread is probably one pound. Yeah. Like, hold on. Uh, keep the stream open. I'm gonna just. Yeah, go ahead. Actually, hang on. Let me calculate something. Oh okay. yeah. Uh. I'm basically saying we should have the stream because I'm hungry. Uh. Okay. Yeah. I don't know if this is. I don't think this is copyrighted. I think this will be fine. Uh, All right. Let's see. Each loaf of bread is 1,814 calories. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna put that up on stream. Hold on. This is the type of bread that'll be like one so, pound. One of these loaves of bread would last an entire day. Yeah. In terms of food. I mean, yeah, they're meant to. It's a one day ration. It is bread. <laughs> one pound bread. One pound of bread. F pound <laughs> of pound bread. Fifteen pound bread. One pound of flour. One pound of sugar. One pound butter. Anyways, yeah, I think that's all for the stream. All right, that bye bye. That was a very fun session. Yeah, Gabagoo. Bye, bye chat. Bye chat. I almost died. I, I was like, 